everybody, it's Bonnie. I am back with a kind of unusual video. A lot of people have been asking me how and why the heck do I polish my furniture with the Bath and Body Works Ultra Shea Cream. So here is one of my bins of Ultra Shea Cream. As you can see, I have way too much. I keep it in this white bin that I picked up at Michael's for 12 bucks. And um, I don't have, um, oh look, I have lipstick on my hand. <laughs> um, I separated out my fall stuff the other day when I did a video. But as you can see, I've got all of my Ultra Shea creams in here. So when I want to polish my furniture, Coco, I just kind of come in here and pick out a scent. Ooh, Sparkling Nights. I love Sparkling Nights. Maybe I'll use that one. Um, if I go below here, I've got all my fall scents down here. So if I want to choose a fall scent, um, I can pick over here and these are some things I just bought. So anyway, um, I'm going to bring you over to my furniture and show you how I do this. Yeah, Hang on a second. Here I have one of my, um, my dresser in my room. I've had this dresser for probably about 17 years. It is wood. Um, as you can see, it's one of those sleigh type um, designs. So what I do when I'm polishing my furniture is I just take one of these washcloths. I buy these in a pack of 10 at Target. Um, they're not very expensive at all. I think they're like $2.99, $3.99. And I have a pack specifically just for polishing furniture. Put a little Ultra Shea Cream on here and I kind of squish it over a little bit. Just like that. And then basically I just rub it in to my furniture just like this. And it shines it up. It does not leave a residue. And holy cow, it smells absolutely amazing. So what it does, and I don't know anything about furniture, <laughs> the components of furniture polish, but my assumption is, oh, I've got my whipped vanilla spice over there. I was going to use that one. Um, but I don't know anything about furniture polish. All I know is I don't like lemon pledge. Um, it makes me cough and sneeze. Um, so you know how like your furniture, look at all the Bath and Body Works stuff I have up here. Um, you know how like your furniture kind of gets dusty in the cracks and stuff? All I know is that this picks up the dust and it leaves my furniture really um, pretty. So I'm gonna try a different piece of furniture. Hold I'm on. back. I have a spare room that I call the library and I've got a lot of my Harry Potter stuff on the shelf. My little black cherry Merlot candle and my shelves tend to get really, really dusty. Now this is just pressed wood that um, came from Target, like bookshelves. So basically, again, I just put a little of my Bath and Body Works on here, and these shine up really, really well. And they leave an amazing scent. Everything just looks nice and new and pretty, and all the dust comes off on the rag. So I do these pretty much every day. I'll come in here and wipe off these shelves because for some reason, I don't know, when the windows are open in the summer, I get like a ton of dust in my house. So I just go through here. My room smells amazing. I've got one more demo for you. Hold on. One more demo for you guys. This is a really old cedar chest that's all nicked up. I think it's probably about 80 years old. I just put a glop of my Sparkly Nights Ultra Shea Cream on here. And then I take my rag and I just, I got a new rag, because once the rag gets kind of saturated, you want to get a new one. So in this case, you can kind of see some residue on there. So what you want to do is rub it all over the furniture, take the dry side, and then rub it out more. So you want to get all of that excess off of your furniture. And as you can see, kind of some dirt on there. Look at that. So I got off a nice bit of the dirt and dust that was accumulating on here. And like I said, this thing's not never gonna look good because it's really old, but I got the dirt off and it smells amazing. So like I said, to me, I use a lot of my old Ultra Shea scents on polishing my furniture. I do everything in our house. I would recommend 
doing a test on any furniture that's like really expensive because I know nothing about the properties of um, furniture polish or what exactly is supposed to happen. All I know is I've been doing this for 18 years and um, my house smells like Bath and Body Works all the time. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed my little demo. Um, like I said, it's, it's a fun thing to do to polish your furniture with Bath and Body Works. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.